And so they came to Archerfield Astrodome in Brisbane for the grand final. Not once, but twice due to rain. The form guide of all the front runners was impressive. This was not going to be a one horse race. Well, the way we've been going, we've been beating George quite consistently lately, so hopefully we can do it again tonight. As much as I'd like to win it, it's that year, and let's hope it can stay that way. Yes, it's a long shot for us, but, you know, we've got to be in it to win it, and we're pleased with the car preparation. We've got a fresh engine in it. We should be giving our best shot. I guess if I'm going to win it, um, I think uh, uh, Max or George has to have a few problems. They have to finish way back down the track a bit. But, uh, but you never know, racing's like that. That can happen. There's a fair amount of... Um, pride, ego or whatever you want to call it on this one and uh, you know it's uh, we've led the chase from, from day one with it and we want to win it again and uh, I think that everybody's the pressure, well we feel that the pressure's on the other blokes. So. The final saw Dumsney on the front row and Tatnell from six. And keep in mind in order to win the crown for a third year the 50 year old had to beat his challenger by one finishing position. Dumsney took off the line like a man possessed. March dropped into second, Rush was third, and Tatnell already to fourth. March then spun as the field closed up, but it was starting to rain harder. Time was running out. Tatnell then started an inspired charge. He rounded up Rush and passed him. The rain, though, was pelting down, and when the yellow came out after an incident involving Gary Rush and Bailu, the decision to declare the contest was taken. Dumsney was the round winner and the new champion too. That's that's racing, but that's all you can do. You know, you can't whinge and moan about it. It's uh, you start off next week and away you go again. It's not a fair result. You know, it's not a, as far as I'm concerned. It's not a it's not a point score race. I really don't think George would have got near us, but it's sort of sad that I couldn't have beaten him in the full amount of laps, so he didn't have anything to whinge about. But George is George, and anyway, it was a good race. Final points for the series showed Dumsney the winner by 120 from the defending champion. Third went to late starter Rush, fourth to March and fifth to Rook Tatnell. So congratulations to Max Dumsney and John Sidney's Valvoline OTR team. A great third edition of the Winfield ASC Sprint Car Series.